This area, very thoroughly worn down. Pigs pulled up some new rocks. It is absolutely past time that we get these pigs moved to a new area. We're on a fact-finding mission at the pigs. I'm doing part of our morning chores, which every day we go out, check on the pigs, look at their fence, see if it's grounding out, which it is over there. Check on the level of their feed and their feeder, check on the quality and level of their water. And uh, as I go through and do my inspection, we're gonna, I'm gonna point out some things that need changing, and it'll lead up to me moving them from this area to a whole new area, but I kinda gotta Assess out the situation, see what I need, any materials, any hoses set up, and because I'm setting up a new fence area in tall grass, do I want to go ahead and go through and bush hog first? That's mow it down so that my grass does the grass doesn't uh, short out my fence as I stumble all over the words. Anyways, let me jump behind the camera. We'll do a walkthrough. So we're on the other side of the uh, tripod now, other side of the fence. As you can see. Pigs have chewed it all up, grass side, not grass side. And as they chew it up and push stuff around, they kick over dirt onto the bottom of the fence and that causes it to ground out. And if they get hungry or spooked by something, if that fence is not hot, then they are going to escape. And chasing down pigs is no fun. So in their feeder, I opened it before I turned the camera on, but we can see we only have about a third to a quarter left so I'm gonna go ahead and make sure I have enough feed. That feed barrel, whole setup, feed, holds about 350 pounds, uh, including that little bottom area. So I wanna bring out at least 200, 250 pounds of feed uh, to fill up that feeder. As I'm walking around, everybody's following me, chewing on my boots. So we got our pig water over here. You can see our, our piggy drinking from it. So it's, the line's not clogged, it's clear, they're getting water, but it's starting to get funky. I'm gonna wanna wash that out and fill it up with some clean water. These are our pig loos. Those just slide around with us. No cleanup or refill necessary. They fill themselves up with pigs in the evenings. So uh, yeah, I would say this area, very thoroughly worn down. Pigs pulled up some new rocks. It is absolutely past time that we get these pigs moved to a new area. Now as we move to the direction that I'm heading in with these pigs rotation, I can see that the grass is pretty high. And to set up that new fence, which I already have a new fence prepped and waiting for me on the outside here, as I'm going to want to set that up, I'm going to need to mow. Now you can set up fence and long grass, but uh, if you've got your bush hog already set up on your tractor, which I just leave mine all set up pretty much most of the summer. Uh, it's easy enough to mow down the grass and that'll ensure that you have a hotter fence going forward. Let's jump on the other side of the camera for some final notes. So what we learned from our walkthrough, we learned a few things. Our pig area, the ground, thoroughly chewed up. The pigs have done their damage. Um, and it's time to get them out of there. Give them some new area, new grass, new ground to chew up and uh, mess around in. With that chewed up ground, our fence is grounding out. By moving them, that's gonna solve that. Our feed, we need to bring out like 200 pounds of feed, 250 pounds of feed. I need to run a hose out here to refill their water. And uh, then they should be good, they should be happy pigs. Not a ton of things to do, uh, but enough for sure. So that was my pig assessment. That's what I do. I do a, a quick check every single day. What do I need before I have to move these pigs? I make a judgment call on what I have to do that day, where they are in their pasture rotation, where I am in my timeline, and then make that call, move the pigs. Subscribe to this channel and you'll see the videos coming up are gonna be me moving the, me prepping the area, me moving the pigs, and the pigs enjoying some fresh grass. Thanks for tuning in. Until next time, I will see you out in the field. Mm -hmm.